I've seen some of these windstorms come through and the damage that they can create. Thousands of North Okanagan residents woke up Monday to a very messy situation right outside their front doors. For one Vernon man, Monday morning storm could have been an extremely costly one. I think it was around midnight last night we could hear the windstorm uh, going through and uh, we heard the noise that sounded kind of more like a, um, I thought a tarp had blown away. Didn't really hear anything that uh, gave the impression of a tree had come down. So I didn't give it another thought. I didn't have any tarps out. And I looked at the window and I could see the uh, tree down across the, uh, across my daughter's car and I could see the hydro line down. So that's, that's when I called it in. It might be right off because the kind of car it is, the frame is, the where the windshield is framed out, that's actually part of the, frame of the car. Among thousands of people now dealing with damaged property, many city beaches and parks also took a beating. High speed winds ripped old trees right out of Vernon's Kin Beach and now city crews are on scene cleaning up the mess. Thousands woke up to no power and many residents along a west side road found themselves stranded because of downed trees causing power lines to cover the road. City staff and hydro crews will continue to work at repairing all the damage across the North Okanagan. For Castanet News, I'm Chantal Deacon in Vernon. Thank you.